Hi everyone, it's Fashion Girl here, and today I'm going to be doing a rainbow tutorial on the Fishtail Rainbow and Bracelet. This bracelet is beginner's level, so I believe anyone can do it. So let's get started on the materials you will need. So you will need um, four things. First, you will need any type of loom. You can also use your fingers, your mini loom, or um, two pens and pencils stuck together. You'll also need your emblem hook. You can use a crochet hook or a plastic hook. You'll also need um, colors of bands. I am using um, this Persian black and this white. You can get the Persian black on rainbloom.com in the white at Michaels. You'll also need one C clip to secure your bracelet. S clips are fine to use too. So let's get started with the tutorial. So for a fishtail bracelet, you will only need two pegs, as I said in the beginning. So just pick any two pegs on your loom. It doesn't um, matter. So to make it easier to loop, I'm starting with my arrows pointing to the right. So um, now I'm just add, getting my Persian black. And you're just going to twist into a figure eight on any two pegs. After that, push your bands down and add your next layer. Now push that those bands down. I'm doing a pattern of black, Persian, white, and Persian black again. And now when you turn your loom to the side, it will look like this. You So you should have three layers. I'm going to grab the bottom layer and pull it over. And I will show it on this view too. And then you're going to grab the bottom layer and pull it over like that. Then you're just going to do the same thing. And now that I pulled my black Persian over, I'm going to add my white. Then I'm just going to go on the bottom and I'm just going to get my white, pull it over. And I'm just going to get my white on this side, on the left side, and pull it over. And then push your bands down. Now that I pulled my white over, I'm just going to add my black Persian band. Like that. After that, I'm just going to do the same thing. Pull over that black band on the left, and then pull over that black band on the right. Like that. And then push your bands down. If you if you like, you can um, grab the cat band and place your hook in the cat band, and then just tug on it like that. It'll make it easier to loop. After that, just add your white since you pulled your black over. And then I'm just going to loop my white over. You can use as many colors as you want. The fishtail bracelet will look good with two colors or one color or three colors or um, as many colors as you uh, would like to use. So um, I prefer to use two colors, but any, like three colors will look good too. Or any amount of colors. So now I'm just... Um, starting to put my black band over and then you're just going to turn my limb to this side and then I'm just going to um, grab this bottom layer pull over and then grab the bottom layer on this side and pull it over and then just pull it down and um, I will show you on this side too so then I'm just placing my white band over get the white band pull it over the white band pull it over. And um, I'm really excited because my balloon rainbow charm finally got to 600 views. And that is amazing. That is like the most views I've ever had on any bracelet tutorial. So um, please subscribe to my channel because I would be so happy. Um, and yeah. So now just keep doing the same thing that you've been doing this whole entire time. This is a super easy bracelet and anyone can do it. So if you begin, you're um, new to Rainbow Loom, or if you are a beginner, this um, bracelet should be your um, your level. Because when I started Rainbow Loom, I did this bracelet, and I'm like, wow, this is like beginner's level. So just keep doing this. Okay, so we're sorry, my dad just came in. And then I'm just adding my white band. And you're just going to loop the bottom 
white bands over. So whatever color band you add on, well, whatever color of band you add on, you will be looping up. If you do not loop that band over, that, that means that uh, your pattern is different. So it might be, it might go wrong. But that's only if you are using two colors. So um, if you're using more than two colors, don't worry about that. So um, only if you are using two colors, this pattern works. Because when I use like three colors or something like that, it um it worked a different way. But it depends. So just keep doing this. Since this is easy, I'm just gonna show you a few more times. So um. Just adding my white, getting the bottom band, and then I'm turning it to the side so you can see, and I'm getting the bottom band. Like that. Um, I'll show you about three more times. Hold on. I'll show you on this angle. And just, if you loop... Uh, the black band on one side then you should loop the black band on the other side so um I lost track but I'll show you two more times now this last time I'll be showing you up close and slow so now you should have three layers on one black Persian one white and one black Persian so what you're going to do is you're just going to take the bottom band on the left and you are just going to loop it over the peg and when it's over the peg you're just going to release and on um, the right side you're going to grab the bottom portion loop it over and release when it's on top of the pegs keep doing this until it's your wrist size so now this um, is what my bracelet looks like so um, I'm ready to show you how to finish your bracelet. So um, you turn your loop to the side and you're just gonna grab the very bottom bands. Pull it over on the left and do the same thing on the right. So it should be the black Persian bands. After that, push that, push your bands down. And that was um, nothing different than what we've been doing. Except there's two layers instead of one, three layers. Now you have one layer here and it should be white. So what you're gonna do is uh, you're now gonna touch your C clip, but you um you are going to grab one end, which is my right end, and I'm just um, going to fold it over to um this left peg right here, the second peg. And after that you can um kind of adjust your bracelet by stretching it out and um you can take both ends and your hook uh, and fold it to this peg right here. And after that, you're just going to get your C-clip and you're going to place it in the middle right here on these two bands. After that, you can take this off. Like that. And, um... I'm just going to um, attach my C-clip to the under, other end of my bracelet. So Now this cap band should be a Persian black. So I'm going to stick my fingers in this band and I'm just taking my C-clip. And I'm placing it with, on this cap band. And there you go. The, that is how you make a rainbow and fishtail bracelet. Please like and subscribe. And um, also check out my, um, I am going to have another nail tutorial. Um, I'll show you how to make polka dot brace, um, polka dot flowers. So um, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Again, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Bye.